Nice. Well, this is a Takamini G330S, and it is from 1981. It's a dreadnought model, solid spruce top, um, mahogany back and sides, and of course mahogany neck with rosewood fingerboard. This guitar has uh, been dormant probably for a couple of decades, and uh, it was in some in need of some attention that I just don't have the tools for. So I took it to uh, my friend Dean Hofford, who does amazing restoration work and repair work, and he's a great builder. Uh, and he spent a, a little bit of time on it, and he got it back better than ever. So it's, it's really good now. So when I got this guitar, um, it was unplayable. <laughs> I mean, really unplayable. He couldn't make a chord on it. It was, it was uh, the strings were super light gauge all rusted out and the neck was straighter than straight and everything was bottoming out and the nut was loose and and so <laughs> nothing serious but uh, it's of course after Dean got a hold of it uh, he says yeah I can fix that in the morning <laughs> so, so uh, Dean phoned me back the next day guitar's done Listen to that. Takaminis and this one included is its cl are their clarity, uh, really sweet necks, really nice action, very consistent uh, quality and and workmanship and amazing note separation. So, which is great because if if you're uh, doing more than just pounding out chords, which is which is fine, but if you want to play finger style or have some some more expressive lines, then these guitars are really well suited to that because you can hear every note. And when you play chords, you can hear every note.
hot picking finger style? Sure. <laughs> Thank you. 